Hi, I'm Leonard from WP Staging. Today I will show you how to fix the error another update in progress. This error can prevent you from updating WordPress. Usually the error message should automatically go away after a while. If it doesn't, there is an easy fix. I will show you that on my computer. First I'd like to explain where you get this error and then we will solve the error. This message is usually displayed when you run a core WordPress update in the background and have initiated a second update process. It prevents you from running simultaneous updates on your WordPress website. During the core update process, WordPress sets a value into the database that logs further updates. The message is set to automatically disappear after 15 minutes or when the update process is finished. However, if you are stuck on that message or don't want to wait, you can manually reset it. Now let's take a closer look at fixing the another update in progress error on your WordPress website. A link to the article for this video is in the video description down below. There are two ways to solve this problem. Both are based on deleting the core updater log option from the WordPress database. I will present both methods to you and you can choose the one that suits you better. Method 1 is based on a plugin that automatically removes the option from the database and with number 2 you delete the database option manually. Let's start with method 1. The first thing you need to do is to install and activate the plugin, fix another update in progress. After activation, open the sidebar menu and go to settings. Then click on the menu tab that says fix another update in progress. If updates are blocked on your site, the message WordPress update is locked will appear. Now use the button named Fix WordPress Update Log. After doing that, you can return to the dashboard and continue as normal. If this method does not work for you or you don't want to use a separate plugin, try out the second method and delete the database option manually. This method requires you to use a database management tool like phpMyAdmin or Adminer to run a query directly on your WordPress database. These steps are identical in both management tools but there may be graphical differences in the user interface. I am working here with phpMyAdmin as it is more popular. The first step is to start phpMyAdmin. Usually you can find it in your cPanel account under the databases section. If your web host doesn't use cPanel, look for the phpMyAdmin or Adminer database management tool in your web hosting account. Select your WordPress database in phpMyAdmin and click on the WP options table of your WordPress site. The search function will show you all the rows inside the options table. Click on sort by key and choose primary DESC. Find the line with the option name core updater log and click on the delete button. phpMyAdmin will then delete the row from your WordPress database. After doing that, you can go back to your WordPress website and continue updating your website without getting that initial error any longer. If you have any questions, write them to me in the comment section down below. Leave us a thumbs up and follow our channel if you want to receive more helpful tutorials and learn more about WordPress plugin, themes, development and everything else important to make your website more successful and getting more visitors. Don't forget to ring the bell to be the first when we've got a new video for you. Thank you for choosing WP Staging and thank you for trusting us.